What's going on, guys? This is Dungeon Master 201, continuing the adventure. Hey, please, come closer. I have something of the utmost urgency to speak to you about. And Do I am at the oasis. Kept waiting. I'm so glad you're here. It's been a while since anyone's visited us. Hmm, because you're such an isolated area. If you wouldn't mind following me, I'll bring you right to him. Just a minute, who are you and what is this place? I'm sorry. In my excitement, I got ahead of myself. I'm Tree Father Birch. Tree Father. I have the great fortune of being leader of his people. Tree Father Tree. tree. Birch is the type Your of tree. Is our home, Oasis. Who is waiting inside? Why, he is, of course. Who is if he? he? Excellent. Yeah, I'll follow you. Let me just put that there. I can't believe you're here. We will see. So we come to this middle thing. So, what's going on here? So, I guess we're going to talk to him. You have no idea how overjoyed I am to see you. You don't even know who I am. Probably for a good reason. I've never seen any place like this. <laughs> this is going to be funny. We no longer use devices like that. We cast our technology away many years ago. Oh boy. Everything you see around you, from the tallest tree to the smallest blade of grass, is a gift. A gift from him. Aha. Uh -huh. The way you're saying him, I could swear you're referring to a god? He's no mere god, my friend. He is the one who grows. He is the one who gives. And he is the one who guides. Thanks to him, the tree minders have a home. I would have preferred that he made the introduction, but I understand your hesitation. The Great One is a God Tree. God Tree. A living, breathing, speaking God Tree. The tree minders are. Yes, I'm going to be killing a God. Watch over us. We care for this place and keep it safe from those who would seek to exploit it. He gives to us, so we give back to him. It's an arrangement that's worked well for almost two decades. Wow. We shun technology and embrace nature. That's the This is gonna be your downfall. Why carry weapons? Sadly. The wasteland is a hostile place, and sometimes we're forced to defend ourselves against it. If that means fighting with manufactured weapons, then... That so kind of defeats the purpose of it, you dipshit. It, you never would have gotten this close to the gates. <coughs> Actually, I probably would have been able to get this close to the gates. Yes, indeed it does. Sorry. I don't speak to outsiders very often, and I tend to get lost in conversation. As you approached Oasis, he said you were coming, and I was sent out to meet you personally with a request. He wishes to meet with you. You'll be the first outsider... I would be honored to meet this person. Yes. To meet him, you must... Up with it. Fine. What's this ceremony? It's simple, really. You drink the... the I assure you, nothing harmful will happen. Okay, let it begin. So I just come up to this thing and just drink. And we got the quest Oasis! Okay, come on. Please 
please drink the sap from the basin. We will now recite the blessing to ward off any harm the outsider may be carrying before he proceeds to the grove. <laughs> Agents of destruction to the power of his divine will. Leave our homes and bodies immediately. Live no longer in them, but pass over into places where you can harm no one. In the name of his essence, I call his wrath upon you. This won't be the first church I annihilate. And diminishing from day to day, you may disappear, except when you serve the health and good purposes of mankind. May no trace of you be found. Abed, may you be so good as to grant us who is to come to judge the living and the dead, and the world by his wizard. Amen. Soon, you will pass peacefully into sleep outside, and when you awake, you will witness his glory first And I passed out. Great. Wow, how the hell did I end up here? Did they like drag my ass here? Alright. Let's uh, go in. Thirty-three experience points, that's kinda nice. What is the point of this little room? Mm. Looks like that there's nothing in here except for a few mire lurks. Looks like a uh, guy died in here. Unfortunate. Really? That means there has to be some other way. Looks like uh, there's something up there that I can't seem to do anything about. So let's uh, head back the way we came. Get our air back. Unless I am, am supposed to go through that door. Ah, there we go. Ugh, you look ugly. Glad to see you're finally awake. I can't believe they made you do that stupid. What the hell are you, a talking tree? When I talk, but they don't hear. That's what the religious uh, people usually are. 
What's the trick? I know there's a guy with a microphone somewhere. Where? You mean in here? Nah. We're old pals. Uh huh. Well, his name's really Bob. Uh huh. I think it's funny to call him Herbert. Okay, you're getting weird. That funny. <laughs> I mean, Bob thing. Well, I suppose you could look at it that way. Well, eventually, he got bigger than me, and then, uh, uh -huh. pretty much ended up inside. How did a tree end up growing out of your head? It was a long, I was exploring some sort of a military base with some other people. Uh -huh. I think it was called Mariposa. 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 We were pretty deep inside and we found some weird va last thing I remember. Uh huh. Let's see. So the tree miner said you needed help. Yes. You're right, of course. I had you brought in here to ask What's the you? Yeah, I'll be happy to kill you. I wish it was that simple. How to put this? I've been feeling right. It's hard to tell where everything is. Anyway, I believe Bob's carries. There is a very easy way to take care of you. You will? Yes. yes. No. But I'm still in here. Yeah, yeah. Goodbye, tree! And we have unlocked the oasis! It's that easy! <laughs> Instead of having to go on that stupid ass quest, you can just burn them! Yes! It's just that easy to complete! Just go in, get drugged up, meet the tree, set tree on fire. Woohoo! And now I gotta deal with all these uh, religious nuts. And since they want to be with the tree... Wonderful way to take care of these guys that originally attacked me. Burning their supposed god. So I guess this makes two religions I've uh, wiped out in the wasteland. Ah, yes. It's very unfortunate that these people had to go, but... I didn't feel like going on one big stupid ass quest. So, I'm gonna go ahead and come back to the capital wasteland. Just having to go through all that stupid ceremony shit. And with that, I'm gonna go ahead and bring an end to this episode. And I will see you guys next time. <laughs>